hello everyone, this is how we're being mentally terrorised by government. First of all, we went through a system which we called education, but it's actually indoctrination because we weren't taught to think, we were taught what to think. And if you're good at that, if you're good at repeating and regurgitating and parroting everything you've been taught, you get an A, you go to the top universities, you get a very good sense of self, right? Your ego is bolstered by this. And so those people typically become the um, middle classes. Those people become the civil servants, right? They've got the, the term servant in their, in their job title, but they haven't really clocked that they're actually enslaved to an insane socio-economic model, just like everyone else, right? So it starts with the education, right? That's what really forms our malleable minds into these reified concrete slabs of mass that seemingly can't think about anything outside of the box, right? And so, unfortunately, the nature of 21st century fascism is purely solely psychological. It makes no sense to do it the way that things used to be done, right? Which is very much boot in your face, or welly and nightmare. Everyone can see that for what it is, and therefore they're going to rebel against that. And so it doesn't have much legs on it, right? So you have got you've got to switch to a more covert method, which is the Huxley's Brave New World type system, right? Of soma drug them on the things that they love on a low level sport entertainment right just music anything that we actually love genuinely you can get you know too much of this of a good thing right that exists so in society we've unfortunately got at the forefront all of this mass entertainment a lot everyone's just hooked to television and you know when they're not at the couch they're at their desk uh, you know they're working away so this is a, co a contracted state of awareness so once you've re reduced the scope of someone's mind you can now fleece them over here because you know they're not looking in that direction they're too busy over here everyone is far too busy and so over here you've got people telling you that monsters are coming to get you when of course that's never been the case and never will be the case because they're simply the excretion of a toxic cell. We talk about that in other videos. Of course, a lot of them have been deleted here on this platform. But if you check out Odyssey, um, you can see some sort of uh, more censorship-free videos. Um, but unfortunately, what happens is through this system of, of government, through the system of politics, what they do is they give you a savior complex. So whilst you're so busy doing all this stuff over here, and you're not looking over there, they're telling you, right, they're pretending to be this father-loving figure. And this is how we've been manipulated. We've been manipulated on our good nature, right? We're being getting played like violins. We're getting pulled on the heartstrings. They know what makes us tick. They know what to say. And like that's why you get all these people, like Barack Obama, he said all this stuff, didn't he? And then, of course, you get like Jeremy Corbyn. He said all this stuff. Well, actually, it's a slightly different story with, with Jeremy Corbyn. But um, these people who are controlled opposition, right, we've got to realise what Vladimir Lenin said. The best way to control the opposition is to lead it ourselves, right? They know that. They are just working this from a high level. They know that it's one system that knows that if you divide people or population, you can rule over them. And the best way to do that is to have this left wing and the right wing and these two different teams are warring. Oh, and he said this and she said this. It's this big pantomime, this big circus. And it's all this psychological manipulation to get us to engage with their theatre. And so, you know, even if you dislike or love whatever they don't care all they need is your attention that's it and then once they've done that they know that we're not going to come together and genuinely rise up and genuinely do something completely uh, benevolent and beneficial to humanity and that's really what this channel is all about it's about bringing people together right we've been divided and ruled so we now need to unite and balance out everything we need to remove poverty we need to ameliorate inequality all the things right that they say they're going to do and they never actually have any plan to devise how to actually go about that they're just simply not interested it's just something to placate and appease your mind so this is why we're being proactive here on this channel we're bringing people together to actually decommodify shelter energy feed and water make those things basic human rights and freely provide those things from the comfort of our own home so we're, de we're devising we're designing we're building and constructing new co-housing projects that are first will be presented to us by way of a sort of hotel operation so that many people from different walks of life can experience this over a short period of time we can all have proof of concept to go forwards and roll this out across uh, the planet all governments should be doing this but they never will unfortunately and it's simply because it's a despotic agenda right it's an orwellian new world order agenda people aren't willing yet to expand an awareness because they're too busy to see that this is the case and it's because We've gone through this system of Western education that no one can see these conspiracies for what they are, right? They're not even conspiracies. I mean, it's just there for everyone to see if they're willing to look at it. But fortunately, the way that we've been conditioned and trained is very much animalistic. It's very much uh, childlike. 
And now we're going to get distracted by this music. Now we want to go to the pub. Now we want to go to this event. Now there's a festival on. Now I've got to mostly work. And now it's the weekend again. So no one is expanding their awareness to the point where you can actually see that this is how you're being psychologically manipulated. And it takes an expansion of awareness. And that's why this whole channel really is geared about expanding human consciousness, as Albert Einstein said. No problem can be solved from the same level of consciousness that created it. So we have to be the ones that come together to do this, right? Because the politicians, they're, they're all fools and they're all psychopaths. They're all just insane. So... <laughs> We need to come together, we need to be the change, we need to be the people, we need to be the 99.9% .9 that we are. Once we're coordinated, once we're organised, we can actually achieve anything that we want to achieve in the world. As Martin Luther King said, those who love peace must learn to organise themselves as effectively as those who love war. Okay, thank you very much for watching, see you in the next video.